what do you admire about athletes? Mm. We've all grown up watching different kind of sports, right? Whether it's yeah. football, badminton, basketball. What um, do I admire? I think mm. for me, the, the thing that I admire about athletes is uh, number one is their focus and their determination to win. When mm. when they set their mind to something that they the the once you step into or you start the game, mm. the the point is to to win. It's not about getting number two, number one. It's always just to win the match. And then another thing is that the strong will and that that mental strength, mm. determination. That, yeah, determination. Yeah, determination. Can you imagine, like for example? Uh, when LeBron James had to had to had to carry uh, Cavaliers in the uh, NBA final last time, I think last last two years, I think, yeah, uh, last two seasons. So imagine he gave his all, he gave everything. You know, he's tired, he's exhausted, he doesn't have that stamina anymore. But but his will, but his mental strength, he wanted to win so badly that that he just go all out. But then after that, they just after the game is over when they won. Or, or either they win or lose, they then there's like only then they can feel all the pain coming in, all the all the all the exhaustion all coming in. And then another thing, the most interesting thing is how athlete manage to control the emotion mm. during crucial time in the game. Mm. So when when you like you're like okay, I'm almost there, I'm almost about to win already. Sometimes when we when we play sport. When we know it, like ah, dah leading dah tak ya, you know. But then, bam, kena sportsmanship lah. Then. Uh, sportsmanship lah. And then, or or at or at the examples like, you know, like okay, uh, okay. Now is like the most important thing that you cannot be, you cannot rush it, and you cannot glojo tak boleh, and then too relaxed also tak boleh. But normal people will always have the tendency is like, oh, skip, 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 skip. Come on, go, 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 on. But then you just you lose your your sense of cool. composure yeah, you lose, already. You lose your cool. If you lose your cool. Lose your composure. Then that that could always lead to to the defeat or you you losing to the game lah. So that one is like you know athlete have that professional athlete have that kind of mentality, mm-hmm. and also the way they give they all out when they when they it's like for the love of the game. Mm-hmm. You know, for the love Game, I I give my life to this like Kobe Bryant mm. gave his life to to basketball uh, with Kobe Bryant. Oh, so he gave, rest he gave in peace. Rest in peace, Kobe Bryant. So Kobe Bryant is a has a a very good example of uh how an athlete is like Mamba mentality. How he like go and like instill the Mamba mentality. You come in here, you do your best, give it hundred percent. Like there's no tomorrow because. Mm. It, don't give you hundred percent for every game that you play, for every sport that you play. Then you're not, you better not be an athlete. You're not giving, giving it all out. Mm. So I think mm. that for me, that's the most inspiring thing, lah. That's the most inspiring thing for mm. an athlete. Jeremy, what he do covered, you love about everything? I don't need to say anything. <laughs> say it, lah. Okay. What I want to say is, it's true. <laughs> <laughs> but I think there's another thing another thing uh, I see, see another thing I see what, 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 okay, okay, what, Jeremy uh, let Jeremy Jeremy Jeremy, 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 Jeremy. All, all, all I think is I mean their, their mentality la, like like he said you know mentality mm. is fucking amazing you know people like me you know cannot uh, you know little bit only uh, I also you cannot know, <laughs> people praise like like my mother always say praise little bit only ah you out already <laughs> <laughs> cannot praise one you, my can mother you... always say cannot praise one you praise okay, me you, you out if, if you are an e-sport gamer same, mm. same, okay same. can you apply the athlete cannot cannot oh. for, for me I cannot lah, but other other e-sport player you know like I mean I'm a I, I would like to watch the Dota players, you know, the international. So when mm. all these big big players come together and then when they play, and then they play in the finals, you know. And then when they play in the finals, you know, you, you have to maintain steady, you know. But then every time we, these uh, normal people, we watch, it's like, man, he's going to lose that game. And then <laughs> they make the comeback, you know. But they, when they make the comeback, uh, instantly, like, like, hey, how it do, how they so steady, you know. They steady. Mm. So that's what... Uh, I admire la, that's it. Perseverance also. Yes, perseverance. Mm. There's a lot of word for it. Perseverance, determination, mm. and resilience. You know, resilience and all those, you know, strong mentality, whatever you call it. You know, just, yeah. I but think, I think least, they have least, to be very passionate. Most yeah. of all, they have to be very passionate. Yeah. 
I think at the time the most the most great I think great. we covered it before yeah. uh, with Eugene. I think athletes have the most great among among uh, if you compare to other people uh, they, they yeah. because how how they how they give their all to the to the sport make them like one of the toughest individuals in the world. Uh. Yeah. They're like real life superhero. Mm. Yeah. People who build houses also got great got great. <laughs> especially in Malaysia right yeah especially in Malaysia you want to build mm. a house like, not easy you know not easy so mm. I think those people build house also equally I got grit got grit lah yeah but, yeah, but, we, but, yeah. but because, because they, they build house from scratch you know from the from the pillar ah. Ah, from, yes. from all the meeting up like yes. it takes it takes a lot of you know a lot of time a lot of time a lot of willpower Determination, mm. perseverance, mm. resilience, mm. Yeah. And love for the game. Yeah, it's like it's like John Wick. It's like John Wick. <laughs> which is why, which is why there is so much when there's so much pressure on an athlete to win, right? I I understand. Mm. Like to, I love to watch a lot of sports documentaries that are like about Michael Jordan, um, about this doping scandal, and then I watched the one about um my Naomi Osaka earlier today, the new one on Netflix. Just three episodes, very easy to watch. And I kind of like it because she talked about her mental health, like, basically. She took a break to, for two months before the Olympics. And the Olympics is actually her first comeback, right? So I think a lot of people don't realize, like, for someone to reach number one, right? Before they get there, the whole life, they're just chasing, 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 right? And then once they reach number one, not everybody knows how to handle what to do with that. Yeah, yeah. What to do with that a win, you know. Especially like Naomi, when she first got number one, she's not even 20 years old. Still a teenager. So young, right? How can anybody handle that kind of pressure? Suddenly, overnight, you are like uh, your country's world sensation. Mm. Mm. Overnight, you're the best in the world. And then you got to continue carrying that weight for what? The next 10 years, 20 years. So then I thought to myself, like, athletes, they didn't become an athlete to get fame. Maybe some do, but most of them became good at what they do because they are good at what they do. They just want to be better, be more skilled, right? And then fame just comes along with it. Like, yeah. like actors and singers, they know that they're out there to entertain. They're creating something for people to see, right? Mm. But yeah. in sports, you're just doing to be better than the uh, than your peer. So, so fame, some... fame is not really there. So sometimes when the pressure gets to them because of the fame, I can totally understand why an athlete would break. Lah. Yeah, I think because another thing is some athletes decide to give their all in sport because that would change their life. Especially when when you become an athlete and you become successful you get sponsors you get paid you get offered mm-hmm. to play in a team you get salary so all those things like you can see a lot of this happening in, in the u.s especially uh, for nba for basketball and other other food american football mm-hmm. teams right yeah, yeah they, they came from they came from the street they came from the street they came from a very normal or sometimes they come from a poor family they yeah, yeah. Yeah. so giving their all to the sport means that when they got selected to be to play to play for a team or, or get drafted, meaning that they have a chance to change their life. Mm. Not just their life, but their family life and then they have a steady income and everything. Those are one of the I think one of the key motivation for them to, to keep doing it's what they do. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But, but yeah. I really like those players, those athletes or whatever. Those who really do it for the love of that game. Yeah. yeah. When they yeah. when they do it for the love, they don't even care <coughs> whether you know they they win or lose, like technically. Mm. Most of mm. them, I mean, most people of course they want to win, but then when yeah. you really love a game like that, you're you're just happy just to be able to play against a very good player. Yeah. Yeah. You know, so yeah. Certain people are like that. So I'm I'm more envious towards that kind of mindset and mentality. Sportmanship, sportmanship mindset. To meet, to meet their, their peer, what do you call that now? Like their rival. Yeah, yeah. To, to, to be, uh, you know, on the same, what we call level, level, playing, last, you know, level so, playing field. Uh, yeah. So it's like, they, they are just as good as you or better, mm. but then you are able to be in that position with them. 
Yeah, mm-hmm. which is high honor, I think. Yes, yes, correct. 